What's up Brave New World, it's Joshua again here with a brand new video in which I would like to complain, state and express something. Rather than complaining, it's more about expressing an idea. And what idea is this? It has to do with The Hunger Games, a fascinating trilogy of books that fortunately I have already read and about which I have already mm, written a report. A personal report which is also an entry on my diary, on my personal diary of course. And by the way, if you would like me to read that entry of my diary, please subscribe. Okay, now just make a comment and request that nicely, alright? If you ask for things nicely, you are more likely to ask them to receive those things than when you demand for those things. And especially if you are ruthless, horrible and bad and downright and downright, downright, oh what's the word, downright aggressive about it, alright? So, uh, so yeah, my issue right now, right here, it's about the pronunciation of the name of this particular character from The Hunger Games. You know the name, you know the name of this character, I'm talking about President Snow. I'm talking about President Snow, who according to the internet, this name is Coriolanus. Coriolanus, according to what I have heard, and according to, let's see, I'm going to write down in Google, how do you pronounce Zeus in Greek? No, that's not the one I'm looking for. How do you pronounce Coriolanus Snow? It's supposed to be Coriolanus, I think. Coriolanus Snow. Coriolanus. Coriolanus Snow. To be honest, as a Spanish-speaking person and as a Latin fan, I'm not a big fan of the name of the pronunciation of that particular way of this name because I prefer to be more like Latin-like or more like my language and be phonetically phonetically coherent when the, with the pronunciation and I would and I choose to pronounce it like this, which is Coriolanus. Coriolanus Snow. And even if you want to make it more English-like. I would pronounce it something like Coriolanus, Coriolanus, I pronounce it for you again, Coriolanus, Coriolanus, no, Coriolanus, no, I'm not a big fan of that, I guess I'm going to start with this new pronunciation, <sighs> you be the judge, right, if you have read the books of the Hunger Games, please you tell me, you be the judge, what do you think is the most appropriate pronunciation of that name, Coriolanus, according to this, the English pronunciation is Snow. In my language, which is Spanish, we would say Coriolanus, Coriolanus. But I think there is a name, a version of this name, Coriolanus, Coriolanus. I prefer Coriolanus. Who is Coriolanus? I know very well that the uh, author Susan Collins decided to take inspiration from Roman names. But who is actually Coriolanus? Who is Coriolanus? Coriolanus. Gneus Marcus Coriolanus, Roman legendary figure. What's the main point of Coriolanus? It uh, makes his name defeating an enemy army and defending Rome. The Senate nominates him as consul, but he cannot win the people's vote. So he's banished from Rome and allies with his old enemy. How fascinating is that? So yeah, back to the pronunciation, Coriolanus. Coriolanus, it's a tragedy of William Shakespeare. Mm -hmm. Coriolanus. I choose to pronounce Coriolanus and from time to time I might pronounce Coriolanus but the decision is mine in the end and the decision is yours. So you tell me, how do you pronounce the name of Coriolan of the president of President Snow? How do you pronounce the name of President Snow? You tell me, you be the judge. Let me know in the comment section. Alright, that's it. I choose to pronounce Coriolanus. Or even Coriol Coriolanus. I think Coriolano in Spanish, but there. In Spanish, before we before before we finish this, allow me to present to you the name of the the pronunciation of this one in Spanish, which is supposed to be Coriolano, Coriolano, Coriolano. And yes, the last two letters, the last three letters in Spanish, and the last four letters in English are one more reason to make fun of the name because it ends in A-N-U-S. <laughs> Damn it. So yeah, Coriolanus. Coriolanus is my proposal for a new pronunciation of the name of the character of Coriolan Coriola Coriolanus or Coriolanus Snow. Coriolanus Snow. And um, yep, 
Coriolanus versus Coriolanus. What pronunciation do you prefer? And by the way, if many people, if blah, in the in the likely case that I am totally outnumbered by the people who prefer to pronounce Coriolanus versus me alone who prefers and chooses to pronounce Coriolanus, go ahead. Uh -huh. I will continue. I will probably continue doing it. However, uh, I'm not going to endorse it so much. Um, but I will continue doing it. That's for sure. Coriolanus, Coriolanus, Coriolanus. Please correct me if I'm wrong. I mean, please give me comments. Give me comments and make comments about the way I choose to pronounce the name of this particular character from the Hunger Games, Coriolanus Snow. Uh, by the way, now that you have reached to this time, which is five minutes and. Three, two, one. Aha, five minutes and 50 seconds. Too long did not read. Mexican guy expresses his concern about the pronunciation of the character Coriolanus or Coriolanus Snow and he expresses that in a video. Alright? He expresses that in a video. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yep. That's it. Too long did not read. A uh, Mexican, Mexican guy expresses his concern about the pronunciation of the name of this particular character from the Hunger Games and proposes his own alternative pronunciation. Instead, uh, apart from Coriolanus, you, can all, you should also be able to say Coriolanus, Coriolanus, Coriolanus if you want to sound more, if you want to sound more English-like, Coriolanus, because hey, I speak a phonetically coherent language, therefore, that's why I'm making this proposal. Thank you so much, Brave New World, and have a wonderful day. Farewell.